Any, uh, any stubborn people in here? Woo! Yeah. <laughs> That's not a good thing to applaud. <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, I'm stubborn, yeah. Nah, I was a stubborn kid growing up. I think a lot of the reasons why I was stubborn because my father was too. I had to tell father when he made a mistake, he blamed the nearest person, right? Like, we all know someone like that. When they make a mistake, they get embarrassed, so they push those stunners on to someone else, right? Because I remember one time my father dropped a glass cup. Mind you, he dropped the cup, but he was standing like, I made the mess, you know? He was like, So you are just going to let the glass clean itself out. <laughs> I said, Dad, I didn't make a mess, you did. So when I made you, so clean this mess up. Yeah. <laughs> we all know an annoying person, right? We're like an annoying person we try to avoid conversations with, right? You all know that? But even that person isn't as annoying as a vegan. Like, like if a vegan person was in band, they'd be the triangle, you know? Nobody <laughs> fucks with the triangle. Okay, I guess you guys the triangle. <laughs> Nah, but uh, vegans are so good just because they don't eat chicken. Like, I personally think if you don't eat chicken, your life is meaningless. That's all I'm gonna say. Cause I'm the opposite of a vegan. I'm African. <laughs> <laughs> we love our roadkill. Like, I eat a rabbit before I came out. <laughs> <laughs> but vegans don't make sense though. Cause like a lot of their foods look like meat but have no meat in it. Have you seen their foods? Like they have a vegan burger, right? A vegan turkey. Even they have vegan chicken nuggets. It's like why do they have all these foods that are dressed similar to what they need to eat? It doesn't make sense. Like me personally, I wouldn't dress like someone I hate, you know? Yeah, it's like a white supremacist leader wearing a dashiki. You know? It's like, fuck niggas, but I can't lie, this is comfortable. Like, it doesn't. Yeah. That laugh is over my depression. You know? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, man. But yeah, now that I'm, I'm about, I feel like an adult now because I have a newfound respect for prostitutes.